This time of the year here in Montana should be considered a state holiday, with hunters spending countless hours in the woods and mountains trying to fill their tags. But for some hunters, that pursuit lasts a little longer than a weekend or even a full season. I've been applying for moose tags um, on and off all my, all my hunting life. Um, but since I've been here in Helena, um, for the last 27 years, I actually put in for 26 years in a row. Almost three decades of hoping and planning and checking. And finally, one day. I checked my email and sure enough, there was fish and game. So I thought I'd better go in and verify that it said unsuccessful. And it said successful. <laughs> I showed the phone to my husband and he threw all his stuff down, jumping up in the air like, you got a mistake! Just like that, after 26 years, this Helena Salon co-owner was on her journey to achieving a dream and continuing a pursuit that runs deep within her family. My dad, um, brother, and um, my son now, my daughter, my Every, everybody, we're all, we're all hunters. Uh, it's just been part of the family. It is what we, what we eat, and it's time spent with family. Um, growing up, that was, that was what we did, and I wouldn't take any of it back. Food and family have driven Stephanie to keep trying to get a moose tag year after year. And that excitement she felt after getting the news that this was her year, was nothing compared to when she took that shot. It was emotional. I was, I um, had to tell him to shut the camera off and I, I, I thanked him. I, uh, my heart was pounding. Um, I knew still the work had to be done. So it wasn't like over yet. And, um, yeah, words words can't ex words can't explain it, you know. It's on my it was on my bucket list, so it was actually a bucket list bucket list thing for me to do. And for all you hunters who haven't exactly had the luck of the draw just yet, Stephanie has some advice for you. Patience, having patience, having having faith, having faith in the system, which. After 26 years, you would think you wouldn't have any faith. And people that say, no, I'll never get it. Well, you won't get it if you won't put in for it. Stephanie has got a lot more information about her story, and you can hear it on our website. Reporting from Helena, Andy Curtis, MTN News.